According to Google, cow milk is a good source of protein, calcium, vitamin B12, iodine and magnesium, which is important for bone development and muscle function. It also has whey and casein, which have been found to play a role in lowering blood pressure. Healthline.com noted that, milk is a nutrient-rich beverage that may benefit your health in several ways. It is packed with important nutrients like calcium, phosphorus, B vitamins, potassium and vitamin D. Plus, it's an excellent source of protein. It further states that, drinking milk and dairy products may prevent osteoporosis, bone fractures and even help you maintain a healthy weight. No doubt, cow milk is valuable in every household and an indispensable ingredient in the kitchen. Milk can be used in baking, making milkshakes, added to tea, coffee or as an ingredient for scrambled eggs among other uses. In this documentary, an experienced farmer will take us through the amazing world of dairy farming. Hello, my name is Gillian Moore. I'm a dairy farmer from Enniskillen. I have been farming now for 15 years, along with my mum and dad. We run a dairy herd with some sucklers and some beef cattle, along with follow-on calves and dairy heifers for her, our dairy herd. Um, uh, we also um, enjoy farming very much and enjoy working outside. Dairy cow farming is all year round, 365 days of the year. It starts at springtime when farmers tidy up the field, plow the ground and apply fertilizer to the tilled soil in preparation for the grazing and silage season. The weather at spring is conducive for open grazing. All cows go out to graze subject to weather. They get meals from the grass which is supported with dairy blend meal which helps with their energy and nutrition to produce milk. The farmer checks on them twice a day looking out for health or any issue of concern. Cows are milked twice a day. Mornings and evenings. Cows are brought out around 7 a.m. into milking parlor. The farmer get the pipes ready, get filters sorted out, Cows all lined up, clean the udders, attach clusters to start the milking process. As they are milked, it is piped into the tank ready for collection. After milking, the cubicles are stripped down, disinfected and thoroughly cleaned out with hot water to keep bacteria away. The cows are taken to the field to graze. They stay there till evening when the evening milking routine starts. In summer, silage is made. Silage is planted grass untouched by animals. It is planted for feeding the cows during winter. After six weeks, the grass is ready to be harvested into the shed near milking parlor and sealed for winter feed for the animals because the routine changes slightly in winter. Meal. Cows feed on wheat-based meal or barley straw while baby calves are fed with chopped up straw and milk. Reproduction Most cows reproduced through artificial insemination AI, administered by experts, brought to the farm or mated naturally by a bull, from other farms. The farmer, keeps a diary of mating schedule. Like humans, cows, have a nine-month gestation period, they give birth to one, or sometimes two calves per pregnancy. Cows, do not produce milk all year long. There is the drying up period, when cows no longer produce milk. This period, is used for the drying up process, when cows that are not milking, are prepared to give birth to baby calves. This takes about two months. Health Matters Electronic monitors are placed on animals' neck and programmed to a smartphone, showing signals regarding the condition of their health. If any major health concern is noticed, the farmer sends for a vet, who would check the cows. 
The vet would then give treatment as needed or advise the farmer on how best to handle the situation. Dairy farming is not all bed of roses. Like other businesses, there are challenges. 1. The weather. The weather is often unpredictable, too much rain is not good for animal health and grazing. Extreme cold weather does affects animals, they often use up body fat quicker that could retard growth. 2. Rising costs. Price of the feed, electricity and water rates are on the rise. 3. Fertilizer cost has doubled up since last year. There is a bright future for dairy farming, despite challenges, if the following advice are heeded. Cut costs where necessary. Keep the business going. Hopefully, dairy market is expected to increase in the near future, bringing in more income. Discover and deploy more application of technology. This will improve production and profit margin. Key into any form of support from government to the industry. Despite the challenges within the business, our future is, is bright, along with our challenges of our financial challenges and maybe hopefully with some government help and new technologies coming through, we will be able to expand and keep, keep our cows happy. In conclusion, the future is bright for dairy farming.